Crikey! It seems to me that we are lost. There's nothing here. Just drive straight and that's it! All right. Slow down, JJ! <laughs> what happened? My head hurts so much. <gasps> what a horror! I hit someone! Where's Mikey? Way Mikey! Are you alright? Wake up, come on! Mikey, where are you? Where have you disappeared to? <laughs> Mikey, one more time, where are you? JJ, what happened? Why does my head hurt so much? Because there was an accident. Look at this, we hit someone! <laughs> what are we going to do now? We don't have a map and we're in some kind of forest at night! The car will definitely not go. It's broken. What a pity. Do you have a torch with you? Maybe we can find a house here? I have a couple. At least you can see the way with this, so take one for yourself. All right. We can say that we are lucky to be alive, but what kind of creature was it that we crashed into, and where is it now? I think it was some kind of animal, and it just ran away. Let's find a house soon. It's very... Ah! <laughs> Who are you? What do you want from us? JJ, what difference does it make what he wants from us? Let's get out of here before it catches us! Exactly! In my fear, I even forgot that we need to escape from this creature. Uh -huh. It seems we've run away from that creature, but where are we now? JJ! Better get in there! There's some kind of mansion there! Let's try to go in there and spend the night there! Because we'll just freeze to death on the street! This house looks so cool! I can't believe someone lived here! Who will buy a house in the middle of the forest? I don't care who bought it! The main thing is that we can now sleep here and keep warm until morning. I think you're right. It's so cozy here. Even though we were in the middle of the forest, this house seemed bigger from the outside, even though there are so many rooms. There's also a second floor. This house is just huge. Let's heat up the food in the oven that's there. Mm -hmm. JJ, look over there. Hmm? Do you see this? It seems there is a descent to the basement. Let's see what's in there. Are you serious right now? Maybe we shouldn't go there. Uh -huh. Whoa. What's going on here? What kind of room is this? Why are there so many bones and- Those strange people in the cage. Don't you think this is something strange? I also think they're muttering to themselves. Let's get out of here. JJ, look at those skeletons. They seem to be quite fresh. Ah! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What happened, hmm? Mikey? Is that you? Why do you look like a scary old granny? Have you seen yourself? You look just like me. Apparently, this stupid grandmother turned us into the same freaks. You're freaks yourself, and I'm still young. Get out of there. I need to teach you something. We don't want to learn anything. We will stay here until we die. Of course not. You will serve me. You need to bring three people like these, who are sitting here so that you can gain strength. After which, I will let you go and you can do whatever you want. So, you want us to just bring you three people to sit here and give us strength? Then why did you turn us into such ugly people like you? That's because you said I was ugly. I will punish these people. You don't like it, do you? Then let's go upstairs. You either bring me three people, or I will follow you for the rest of your days. Okay, but that's not because we don't want to be grandmothers anymore, but because seeing your ugly face is even worse than being persecuted to the end of our days. You should be grateful to me that I didn't kill you. So go outside and look around. Do you see anything? Let's see! Well, it's very beautiful here. It's strange that the day has already come and the night has passed so unnoticed. Because you're an idiot. It's night outside, and you can see well, because it's one of the abilities of people like us. And it would be better for you to catch some person until I come back. Otherwise, I will visit you in your dreams. Okay, Mikey, I think we have no other choice. It seems we need to do something. Let's just try to wait in the house until someone comes. I'm sure there will be more stupid people like us who walk through the woods at night. I think so. Let's go to the second floor soon. From there, we will be able to look at the street very well because there's a beautiful view. How long do you think we'll have to wait for this grandmother and some person who will go to this house? I don't think for long because there's already some guy walking over there who apparently got lost in the woods. I think he'll definitely go into this scary house and try to look for a place to sleep here. JJ, we have to wait until he comes in. I think we can scare him in the house so that he is speechless and then put him in a cage in the basement. Mikey, it seems that he has already entered the house. Let's go outside and scare him from behind so that he is generally stunned. I think this is the perfect plan. Let's do it. It seems he's already inside. We'll be waiting for him to be in the living room. 
So, this house looks awesome, but who would live in such a big house in the middle of the forest? It's also so scary here. The constant feeling that someone is looking at me and also these footsteps will scare me to death. You don't even know that you're right. Someone is always looking at you. That's it. Someone else is talking to me. I'm the one talking to you. Can you keep it down? We want to tell you something. Hey, stop. Okay, Mikey, we need to knock him out. He's too noisy. And he's fast. How do we catch him? Hey, wait! Stop running away! Just go into our basement and sit there! It's not that bad there. There will be just those with whom you can chat. And now it's time for you to sleep. How loud you are! Don't you want to pass out? You seem to have shouted too much. He's finally asleep. My ears were already aching from his screams like a man, but he screams like a little girl. My ears still hurt from his screams. I'm even a little glad that we're putting him in a cage. I thought my ears would give out already. But now he'll be quiet. I do not know when he will wake up, and I think he will sleep for a very long time. And even if he wakes up, he has those with whom he can talk. I think I can already hear two more people approaching our house. Let's take a look at them and figure out how to scare them. Mm -hmm. All right, they're already coming. Let's go up to the second floor the same way as the first time. Wait until they come in and scare them from behind again. Hot Yaoni look dangerous because one of them has a sword. But this does not scare us because we are the ones who should scare. So let's go take a look at them. Alex, I'm telling you again that it's not worth killing horses to eat. Look where we are now. What a scary house in the middle of the forest, and we don't even know who lives or lived here. Let's at least take a look around here. Mikey, I had an idea. Give me dynamite, and when they come out, we'll blow them up, and then just put them in a cage. Mm-hmm. I'll put the dynamite here, and you put a redstone trail to it, and when they get to the dynamite, blow it up. I'm sure it will work. So all that remains is to wait. Yep. Alex, I don't want to stay here. Did you see what was on the second floor? There's someone's blood in there. It's also fresh. We definitely need to get out of here as soon as possible. Hmm? What is that sound? Alex, stay close to me. Hey, is there anyone here? Ooh, JJ, it really worked. You're just a genius. And now we need to pick them up and... What? What did you want to say? Eat us? I won't let you do that. What? Nah, but you said you wouldn't allow it. And now you're going to go to your new friend's cage. Mm-hmm. But why did I get the most hits? It was very painful. I hope there's an ugly granny eat him. I don't know what will happen to him, but I think that he will definitely not stay alive. So let's just put him in a cage and wait for that granny. It seems she's already coming here. Do you hear her footsteps? She's so fat that you can hear her footsteps coming from the basement. What were you saying there? You'd better keep quiet, because I can say that you are great. Great job. Now I have to absorb these people. You eat them while we get out of here. Isn't that what we agreed on? Mm -hmm. Hey, hey. But you didn't fulfill the conditions. It took three people, and there are only two here, so I'll have to kill you. Ah! That's not what we agreed on. You said you'd let us go. Mikey, let's get out of here before this crazy woman catches up with us. <laughs> JJ, she's so scary, I almost died from her terrifying face. What? Huh? Do you want to die from my bat? Then come here. <laughs> JJ, run! This ugly woman caught up with me. <laughs> Oh. JJ, do you want to see your friend? Then don't leave. I'll show you a joke. Leave me alone. You're so ugly. Ah! Uh. A few moments later. Hey, let's go outside. We have to go gather some resources. Are you kidding? We have a lot of foods and stuff. Wait a second. Why there is nothing in the chests? Hey, Mikey, what are you doing there? Just crafting some items. Okay, let's go to the shop. I hope there is something. Some villager says that shop is out of food. And I hope it's just wrong information. Hey, Mr. Villager. Do you have something to eat here? <laughs> I guess he says there is nothing. And this cow is for sale. But it's too expensive. We can't afford it. What are we going to do, Mikey? I want to eat something. I don't know, too. Those villager already planted a lot of food in the shop. So bad for us. We didn't make wheats, so we will be hungry for days. Hey, do you see that? I see a poster there. So strange, Mikey. Let's come closer. We need to check it. Yeah, you are right. We have to check it. There is also a building that wasn't here yesterday. Okay, now let's see what's here. JJ, I see a poster. Time machine? Is it a joke or what? JJ, it's a scientist villager. He is smart. Remember, he saved us from zombie attack. Now he is here. Is it your time machine? Cool. Hey, Mr. Villager, can we try it? I guess we can. 
Hey, wait a second. He put something. $64 for time machine? What? Why is this so expensive? We can't afford it. No way. Yeah, Mikey, we are too poor for that. But you know, I wanted to go back a few months to buy food on the cheap when it was still. Hey, wait a second. Do you see that? Is it a shaft there? Oh, Mikey. We can mine a lot of emeralds and other ores to sell it and change them into money. Yeah, JJ, it's a cool idea. Look, I have two pickaxes. Take one and let's go to mine. We have a lot of job to do. We are so lucky that we meet that villager and found this shaft. Yep, you are totally right. A few inches later. Hey, Mikey. It's so amazing that we've mined a lot of emeralds. It would be enough for the time machine. Hey, let's go to the cellar. We are so lucky. I can't even imagine that we are going to use the first time machine. Hello, Mr. Villager again. We have a lot of emeralds, and we want a lot of money from you. Thank you, Villager, for that. Now, Mikey, let's go to the scientist. We need to buy that machine faster than other Villager. We have to hurry. JJ, I want to travel. Yeah, we will travel. Don't worry. Now let's go to the Villager. He waited us too long. Hey, mister, take our money and please give us this time machine or at least teleport us when Earth had a lot of food. Yep, I want to eat so much that I could eat even dinosaur. Hey, Mikey, see, he wants us to follow him. Let's go to the time machine. We have to see this. We spent our life only for this experimentation. JJ, he wants us to go inside. Come on, we need to try that. Yep, I am so happy. Hey, Mr. Villager, is it working? I am a little bit scared. Don't worry, of course it's working. Just relax and woo! Ah, Mikey, something is happening. Everything moving too fast. Ah! JJ, chill out, chill out. You need to relax, just chill. See, that's all right here. Why are you look like a trash? What do you mean? Hey, what is happening? Why are you look like caveman? And what this villager made with us? Whoa, it worked. It really worked. It's amazing. But we are not in the village. Why are we here? I don't know, but let's ask him. He must know everything. Hey, he points at this red blocks. I guess we need to mine them. Yeah, you are right. Thank you, villager, for these shovels. Hey, villager, wait. Oh, no, he teleported back. But I still don't understand why we are here and not in the village. Oh, no, Mikey. Wait a second, JJ. I guess we are here because I told him about dinosaurs. So he teleported us here. What are we going to do? I don't know. Let's just dig this red thing so we can see what's here. See, there is a chest. There are might be. What? Weapons? And why there are many of them? Look, I am the hunter. And oh, man, how is that possible? I have a dino weapon. Whoa, it's so amazing, Mikey. It also makes sounds. I guess it feels like a real dino. But, you know, I kind of like this world. There are food everywhere and a lot of trees. In our world, there is nothing. Let's explore this world. I guess there is no dinosaurs here. They are dead for sure because of that meteorite. Yeah, you are right, JJ. We can make a house here and a lot of different things. Nobody will stop us. Hey, do you see that? What in the world? A lot of monsters are there looking at us. What are we going to do, Mikey? I don't know, but let's kill them all. Shoot from here. Nice. I'm shooting, shooting. Help me too. Hey, we can kill all of them from this range. I am sure they won't be able to even touch us. Good luck. I want to have some fun. Ha 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 ha. Mikey, what have you done? They will eat me for sure. Help me, Mikey. Shoot from all weapons and from dino weapon. Oh, what in the world? A monster? No way. Mikey kill. They are so scary. We have to hurry or they will eat my brains and other bodies. We are in danger for sure. I want to make chicken from them. JJ, it's so amazing to shoot them. I am so excited. Hey, come on, monster. Eat me. Ha ha ha, you can't because I am trash. Monster won't eat me. Never and never. JJ, why are you shooting like a baby? Come on, be more faster and don't be scared. What are you talking about? I am trying to survive from them. We must kill them all or we are going to die for sure. Come on, Mikey, help me already. There are a lot of them. Use your guns and swords at least to make some damage to them. We are going to die if we stop. Why are they want to eat us? They want to eat your brains because you are too smart. I am not smart. My brain's too dummy. See, they can't even come close to me. Don't talk too much. We have to make sure to survive at least. I guess we are winning this battle. Come on, Mikey. We are almost killed them all. Just a few more. They are strong, but we are better. No, 
My beautiful monster are dying! Why? I want to make a good food from them! They are so tasty! Meh! Mikey, what are you talking about? You will get toxic things in your body! No way you will eat that! Come on, there are a few more, and we are done! I am so happy that we are so strong! We destroyed everything and everyone here! Yep! I am so happy! See, there wasn't scary monsters here! Just a lot of dummy creatures that wanted to eat us! Yeah, Mikey! Look, I guess there is a civilization here. Let's look closer. We can find something cool here. At least other time adventures who already build everything here. Oh, it makes sense. If we could teleport in time, someone could done it before. So it's a matter of time that someone will make cool building like this. Come on, Mikey. We have to clear everything here. Follow me. We have to make sure there is no enemy. We will be so happy if we clear here. Come on, don't